Okay. We're All live. Right. We're live. All right. Here we are at the Kins Pro Sound YouTube new streaming studio. Just want to do a quick little uh, live stream video to say hello to everybody and uh, do a little bit of update at uh, Kins Pro Sound here in Fairfield, California. So uh, we're going to talk a little bit about our website, a little about what, what we're going to be doing in the future. And we got a couple of products, just some reminder products to show you that we have in stock. And we're going to be stocking more things and a lot more stuff to come available. So first thing we want to do is just real quick uh, uh, check with uh, my uh, partner here, Jace. This is Jason Fiore. He's helping us with the uh, social media. And uh, he's going to be, uh, I'm sure tonight we're going to have just lots and lots of people checking in on the chat, right? <laughs> yeah, this is all fairly new. For us, yeah. just recently set this up, and uh, I'm just here making sure it appears we've been live for about 45 minutes, so hopefully it caught everything you had to say. 45 minutes? Uh, 45 seconds. 45, yeah, wow, <laughs> that was a that was a quick 45 minutes. Well, anyways, Jason, do we have the uh, the splash screens ready so we can uh, we can do that? We are so ready. We are already ready, so here we want to do, we just kind of want to go in here and remind everybody, you know, about uh, kinsprosound.com. You know, uh, we have a full-blown website. And uh, you can go to the website, you can check out the products, and you can also give us a call or email us. So you notice there at the very top of the screen uh, for contact information, there is a toll-free number. It's 877-577-6863. And uh, for those of you who want to remember it a different way, it's 877-KP-SOUND. Spell that out on your phone, 877-KP-SOUND. And we got just a few of the highlighted products on the front page. You'll notice there's the uh, Behringer products and JBL products. And uh, we've got Allen & Heath products, Sure products, and just a whole lot of different stuff. And uh, like I said, if you have questions, don't see it on the website or want to call and get some help. Just pick up the phone, 877-577-6863. All right, Jason, thanks for that. I really appreciate it. So what we're going to do tonight is just to, just to uh, talk about a couple small products and what we're going to be doing in the future. So let's take a little bit what we're going to be doing in the future is really simple. We're going to be doing a lot more videos and we're going to be having guests here that from the different manufacturers. Some examples would be sure uh, would be Allen and Heath, uh, JBL, the Harmon Group, uh, Audio Technica, and uh, things of that nature and there's many many others so we're gonna be bringing some products out here and just showing you how to do it uh, and showing you how to hook some things up for example some of you folks out there in the uh, church market in the school market uh, you're doing a lot more videos and, and you want to know how to hook a few things up everything from projectors to uh, screens video switchers video mixers right now we're using the uh, Roland the VR4 HD that's how we're doing this cool stuff so we can get to all the different views. Here's a view in case we wanted to put something on the table. There's another angle. And let me see here. Here, I'll just pop it up. Jeremy's looking at the analytics and everything on there. And uh, so we're able to do all kinds of stuff with the, uh, the good old VR4H from Roland. And Roland has a whole line of products. So we're going to be showing you this one. And there's a less expensive version and there's more expensive versions. So it's kind of all over the map. And then an, a little bit later on, we're going to be bringing you some uh, uh, videos and still photos of some of our installs, some of the uh, concerts and the AV uh, rental stuff that we do. So basically what we're trying to do is just get in touch with you folks, give you an opportunity to contact us, ask your questions and get your problem solved. So right now we're just going to do a real quick, it's kind of a reminder. So what we're going to do is we're going to put this out here right in the middle of the table show you how that's gonna work there you go so here's the old fat the uh, old faithful the Assure uh, SM58 so I'm gonna talk just a little bit about the Shure SM58 the uh, oh there we go we're even more in the frame thank you so the Shure SM58 microphone that is just like the box says that's a legendary vocal microphone that was I think it was, uh, I don't know if it was created or put on the market approximately approximately 1966. So that microphone has been around for, what, about uh, 53 years? Long time. That's a long time. So this guy here has been around for 53 years. 
And sometimes we forget how durable and what a workhorse this thing is. So when you guys decide to buy a basic all around super rugged microphone, let's not forget our good old faithful SM58. So what comes in the box? Well, obviously you get the microphone, which is right here, get the instructions, which, you know, that's kind of a given, and the warranty, and then they're going to give you a, uh, a sure strap, which is used to put on your um, uh, cable, and of course you can buy the microphone with, with or without a cable, and um, by all means buy a mi microphone with a cable, we have those too. And we stocked the new SM58s. We've also got the Beta Beta 58 and many others. And uh, you'll notice it comes with the Shure is kind of known for their really cool bags. The Shure Ziploc bag to put your microphone in to protect it when you're carrying it around. You know, and the, um, the classic Shure microphone clip. So that's what you get in the box. You get the microphone and you get the uh, uh, clip and you get the uh, um, you get the microphone, the clip, the Ziploc bag, and the instructions. So the Shure SM58 microphone, I think sometimes we just take it for granted. You've probably heard the uh, um, the old saying, "Man, this microphone's so tough, you could drive nails into the ground with it." Yeah, it might be. These windscreens right here are super tough, and they're also they're interchangeable. So there's the inside of the microphone, and I'm not going to unscrew the back part. But by the way, these windscreens, these are replaceable. We stock the SM58 windscreens pretty much all the time. So if you have an older, I'll let you do that, Jason. I'm gonna if you have an older uh, SM58 microphone that uh, you are um, trying to clean up, you know, there's got it's got uh, I don't know lipstick rust. It's dented because it really did get dropped from a long, uh, off a stage from, you know, five or six feet or something. Uh, and the microphone probably still works fine because they're really, really almost indestructible. Uh, we've got the windscreens. So we got the microphone. We got the replacement windscreens. We got the cables. And if you want the Beta 58, we got that. And if you want anything else from the Sure line, we also have that. We'll be bringing in uh, some of the really nice Sure wireless systems. You know, we'll probably start out. Uh, in the early stages, we're going to let you take a look at the uh, the new PGXDs, uh, the digital uh, uh, wireless systems that have an S SM58 head option for them. Uh, we're going to bring in the um, the, the ULXS, the uh, SLX, and we also, uh, of course, the uh, ULXDs. ULXD microphones, those things are so awesome, and we're going to invite our friends from Sure to come in here uh, a couple of times and hang out with us, but even before we do that, we'll bring those microphones here and let you take a look at it. So the Shure SM58, the classic handheld vocal microphone from 1966. It's relevant then. It's even more relevant today. Now, can I get it in different colors? I, I don't think so. That's the standard microphone. Standard? Standard microphone. Got yep. it. Now, if you want that to be, you can put a windscreen in different colors. Shure makes a whole line of windscreens that are different colors. So okay, you can put, so you the can, top. Yeah, you slide, yeah. It over, you slide it over the top. Yeah, <clears throat> but our standard stock stuff is all, it looks just like that, the classic SM58. I just wanted to do that because everybody sells SM58s. Everybody knows about SM58s, and I think sometimes we take them for granted. Matter of fact, just recently, we were going through our microphone kits, and we had some other microphones and, and whatnot, and I'm like, you know what? Just take the miscellaneous microphones out that, and, and put, 58, put those 58s in their place, all 58 vocals. And you know what? You get up on stage, and if all your vocal microphones across your front, especially if you've got one monitor mix, and everybody's listening to the same thing, and you got four vocal mics or five vocal microphones, if they all match, they all have the same a timbre, and uh, the EQ is very similar, it makes it a little bit easier to manage, and they're just wonderful microphones, and uh says, thank you, Sure, for keeping this microphone around and keeping the quality of it up so high for so long. Over 53 years, 1966, the Sure SM58. You, have a, you want me to bring that up on it? No. Oh, oh, no, okay. Oh, you know what? He was asking me. I, I'm, I'm kind of slow, 
and the and you say, do we want to plug it in? You know, I don't know if we're going to plug it in right now because I don't have a cable set up. That's a really good idea. You know what we're going to do next time? We're going to take like an SM58 and we're going to take a, uh, a one of their nice condenser microphones and a KSM microphone and let you guys, you know, the best we can over the web stream, uh, hear the difference in the microphones. That's a really good idea. Because this is a dynamic, right? That's a dynamic microphone. And these are condensers. These are condenser microphones. So. Sure makes a line of really nice condenser microphones, and uh, we'll be showing those off. As a matter of fact, we'll probably get some KSMs in here in the near future to have these up here, and we'll probably be using those for our, our, our YouTube TV in the very near future. So anyways, what we're going to do is we're going to move right along. We got one more Sure product that I want to bring to your attention. Uh, but before we do that, I just want to remind you, we're going to provide you with a link uh, to our website that has uh, more information about the SM58 and where you can buy them and how you can get in contact with us. So enough about the SM58 for now. Thank you, SM58. You've been an absolute warrior, an audio warrior. That's what SM58 is. A workhorse. A workhorse. That's even better. I said warrior. We're not fighting anybody. I'm older than you. Or That's working. how I know these old. Yeah, he's older than me. Yeah, yeah right. So now what we're going to do is we're going to talk a little bit about in-ear uh, wireless systems, wireless in-ear systems. And uh, the right here is the uh, Shure PSM uh, in-ear monitor system. And I'm going to open it up and do kind of a, a real quick unboxing. This is more of, of a review, okay? We want you to know that typically we stock the uh, PSM 300 series and we typically stock the this version that has the transmitter, which is right here. And I'm going to be pulling the transmitter out in just a moment and let you take a, t let you take a look at that. And the transmitter we have is a the um, uh, metal box. So what comes or excuse me, metal case. So what comes in the box? Let's do this. We're gonna uh, we're gonna punch this button and we're gonna punch that button. That way, you know, we we want you to know who's talking to you. Okay. <laughs> you know, we don't want you to we want you to forget how good looking uh, this other guy is. So, anyways, so what comes in the box? You get the instructions, and these instructions are really really thorough. Answer all kinds of questions, but keep in mind if you buy a product from Kins Pro Sound or KinsProSound.com, give us a call. If the person answering the phone doesn't know the answer, that person will get a hold of somebody in our company that does know the answer. Right off the bat, Jason picked up the uh, the famous Sure bag. They give you a bag to put your trans, your excuse me, your receiver pack in. So we're going to pull this piece of packing out here. Let's pull this up. See what else Sure gives you. And Sure gives you a lot. They actually do. These are a really good company. So right here, brand new in the box, is a pair of earbuds. They're inside here. You know what? I'm going to go ahead and open them up. Well, I think, I think you guys are worth it. We're going to open them up. So you get a basic set of earbuds with the system. I'm, I don't know if they're in here or if they're in the other box. Oh, here they are. So here's the earbuds that come with it. You've got multiple uh, adapters for different size uh, individuals. So I'll try to get them fit. These aren't custom, but these are really good sounding earbuds and they come with it. So you can use this thing with the eighth inch connector right off the bat. You don't have to buy anything. It comes with this power supply for the transmitter. So this power supply plugs right into the AC outlet. And I think most of you have seen a, uh, what we affectionately call this is not a wall wart this is a cable lump it's in the middle this piece here plugs into the back of the transmitter the other side obviously plugs into your uh, 120 volts your your handy dandy electrical outlet so let's get to uh, kind of the meat of the thing here is the, um, the transmitter the transmitter on these uh, PSM 300s are they're beautiful little transmitters um, they have uh, on the back they've got your right left audio in they've got right left audio out and you know something I forgot to do when I was uh, getting ready to do this is put my glasses on because I wanted to tell you about on the back you've got the switch back here that flips your switch between mono mix and stereo mix so you can just have one input and flip it and it just works and then uh, you can take over here and this, the input right left channel goes in here and you can loop it output. 
So if you had several of these in a rack, say you had two of them side by side, and they're receiving the same, the same exact mix, you could bring your cables over and then just jump them over. And then another feature that these guys have is you can put it into, you can put two signals into it, and you can have, a, as an example, the right channel could be the, the music, and the left channel could be vocals, and you, there's a function on your, on your receiver to uh, adjust the level of that individual. It's, a, it's the balance control. So this is the transmitter right here. And the transmitter also comes with, in the kit, is your rack mount kit. So I'm not going to take it all the way out. But right here is your rack rails to mount the thing. And what happens is, is if you buy one, you get these two rack rails here, a long one and a short one, and that's how you would mount one unit into one rack space. So if you buy two units and you tie them together, and what's cool, Sure gives you right here, I'm gonna keep the screws in here so we don't lose it, it's right here. This is called the joining plate, and the joining plate goes between the two transmitters here, so the second transmitter, and the screws go into here to hold the two together, and then you use the two short rack gears, and then this thing will mount side by side with two of them. So you can easily put four of these in two rack spaces, and Sure gives you all the hardware to do that. They also give you a an, extent, an antenna extension kit, which is really nice because it's, it's and they're just so great about giving you all the pieces. So when you get this thing, you could turn it on and use it. So if you noticed, I was going probably too fast, but in the front ear right here of the rack mounting, and let's get it there so you can see it better, there is a dual female BNC connector that fits into this hole, okay? So we mount it into this hole, and then you can use this cable here, which is a BNC to BNC, it's the RF antenna cable, and it can go to the antenna connector on the back, which is right here, and this wire will remote the antenna that is supplied to the front of the rack. So if you had two of these, a very, very simple system, you had two of these PSM 300 systems, the sound quality of things is just marvelous. And you had two of them in a single rack space, so you're a duo, a couple of vocalists, and you're, you're, you're traveling around. Put these in the rack, and you can have an antenna on each side, and it works very, very well. Something I want to touch on before I move on to the receiver right here. This is included in the system. The transmitter we just showed you that transmits the audio from the source to the receiver. And the receiver you wear somewhere on your person. Here's a clip. It can also go in your pocket. And also, here's where the batteries go in. And the supplied earbuds can go into here. Okay? Now, I want to touch on something. The earbuds, you can use the ones that come with it. You can have custom ones built or excuse me, custom ones manufactured for you, get impressions made and they'll be uh, made just for you and only you. And if you have a person in your band uh, that plays an instrument that they don't really want to have the uh, these earbuds or the custom earbuds, there you can take your, your high quality um, earphones and plug them into the Asians jack. And I use, I use the Shure 840s. When I walk around, I use this in the mo for monitoring. Absolutely marvelous. Sounds really, really good on, on a good pair of headphones. So I just want to touch on that. And this guy here is the, is the metal version of this. They offer this transmitter and the standard plastic and the updated metal. And I, I like the metal. It, it feels better. It's built really well. And it, they're, just, they're just beautiful pieces. So I'm going to set this down for a minute because what I want to do is really quickly, we're going to touch on the transmitter one more time. The transmitter on the PSM 300, as we've already stated, comes with the rack mount kits, comes with the remote cable to put the antenna on the front of the rack so it's ready to go. And then you get two of these things and you can do two of them. Well, let's say you get three or four. It's not uncommon to purchase four of these, install them in a, 
a three or four space rack with the supplied rack hardware. And then it would be highly recommended to use the in-ear transmitter antenna combiner. And what that does is it takes the four outputs from the antenna connector, brings them to a fifth device that's in your rack, and then that device combines your antennas and you have one antenna. We're gonna go into that in more detail later. I wanted to touch on that quickly because I know some of you, they're gonna catch up on this video and you're gonna look at it and you're gonna say, man, that guy didn't say anything about uh, combiners. Well, that's a whole nother video, but I wanted you to know that combiners are available from shore as are the um, higher quality antennas that are directional. Uh, so it helps you uh, cut it, get your energy focused where you want it and cuts out on interference even more. One other thing that's kind of, I, I, I think it's great. Sure gives you a brand new set of Energizer AA real, batteries. Real batteries. Real batteries. Yeah. They don't, I, I don't want to mislead you. I stuck a pair of Amazon uh, batteries in here, which aren't bad, by the way. But you could put the Amazon batteries in here. But Sure gives you a pair of batteries so you can literally use this device right out of the box. You hook it up, you bring it up, it's got the batteries, the power cord, and sure has thought it all the way through for you, it's ready to go. And um, in addition to the batteries, and we'll go into that a, a little more detail later, um, Sure offers a complete line of batteries and battery chargers. You can put rechargeable battery in here, and on the back of this pack, it's, let me see if I can get it here. There it is. That supplies the energy to charge the rechargeable batteries inside. So that'll be another video. We'll put the rechargeable batteries in. We'll show you that, we'll show that to you and uh, show you how that works. And then you turn the unit on, the unit comes on and uh, you know, it tells you what channel it's on. Uh, we're on G2 channel E. And if you wanna know the frequency, you can change the display and look at that. You can look it up on the chart. But the uh, bottom line is they're easy to use. You have one knob. You just take this knob on the top, turn it on. The green LED indicates it's receiving. It's ready to go. So anyways, what we really wanted to do today was just reintroduce ourselves as Kins Pro Sound. It says the audio system specialist right there on our tag on the Kins Pro Sound logo. Uh, Kins Pro Sound here in Fairfield at 877-577-6863. You can reach us at kinsprosound.com. Go to the website and you can uh, either call or you can email us and we'll be happy to talk to you. And really what we want to do is reach out, offer a personal touch and uh, just make your acquaintance and give us a call with any of your questions and we will do our best to answer it. And if there's any question you ask us, and for some reason we don't know the answer, we will find out and get back to you. So with that, I think we're going to call it good, Jason. What do you think? Yeah, yeah, it looks excellent. Yep. little reminder about the good old SM58 microphone from 1966, our workhorse that's been around for a long time, and we really like it. And um, also the uh, uh, let you guys know that we're uh, stocking the... Uh, PSM 300 series. Now, I don't want you to think the PSM 300 is the only one. We do uh, have made available the other Sure in-air systems, the higher-end stuff. So if you're interested in that, give us a call, and we'll be happy to talk to you about that as well. And, and in the future, we'll be doing some actual uh, operational videos. Today was just a box opening. Um, let's chat about it and uh, let you know that we, uh, we're here. Yeah, I'd say the next one we could have a couple mics set up. Oh yeah, yeah. I think we're and then we that. can we can switch to them. We're yeah. just not. Uh, we didn't have all the cables brought out for that. Yeah, we we just decided today that we were just gonna get on the old uh, YouTube channel and uh, say hi to everybody and uh, uh, just hope we uh, generate a little bit larger audience. And uh, we're gonna be doing a lot more stuff. Our channel is gonna get busier and busier. And uh, when uh, we do the next one, we're going to put it out on Facebook, Instagram, and let you all know here, our YouTube subscribers, so that you could join the chat and uh, ask questions live and whatnot. And also, we're going to be doing some videos as well, some um, uh, box opening kind of things. But 
uh, one of the things we're going to be doing is we're going to bring in the Allen and Heath, the SQ series consoles, and we're going to be showing you how those work and how you can take the consoles and tie them together. So you can have a front of house and a monitor board or a front of house and a recording console. Uh, we're going to bring in, uh, we actually have them here. Uh, we'll bring in from the warehouse, we'll bring in the, uh, the Behringer X32s, and we're going to do a little quick video on that and show you how that uh, we're using the uh, digital snake function on that to tie those consoles together so you can have, um, you know, 32 inputs from the stage uh, through your Cat5, and you can split that 32 inputs and have a house console and a monitor console. And uh, we're con your comments are welcome, and uh, your questions are welcome. And uh, we'll be interested in knowing if you are interested in some tech videos on, for example, uh, I think what we're going to do is one on the uh, how to connect your, your iPhone or your uh, Android phone or some small MP3 player that either has the 8th inch uh, mini jack, uh, the TRS the mini jack, or an Apple device that uses the Apple certified uh um, connector um, connecting those to your console sometimes directly to the microphone inputs with a 8 inch to XLR type adapter uh, with phantom power turned on on your board is sometimes not the best thing to do so what we're gonna do is we're gonna go have a short video that's kinda gonna dovetail with our we have some two-year-old direct box videos that are real simple and we're gonna extrapolate on that a little bit and I'll show you some other product that's very cost-effective that will match your portable devices to your large sound system in a very safe and easy to connect way so that you don't have that. I had a friend of mine that actually had a, a, an Android phone. It was working great until somebody uh, accidentally used one of those adapters, plugged it in, and actually um, uh, damaged the output device on his 8-inch uh, plug. So uh, it didn't work till he got a new phone. So we don't want that to happen to you. So we're going to show you ways to avoid that. And uh, we're also going to show you some other really simple stuff, some other things that are uh, products out there that are Bluetooth controlled, uh, ways to get your audio into your system through your uh, phone for playback uh, through the Bluetooth. Even if your system doesn't have it, there's adapters out there that you can do that as well. We have a lot of things planned for you. Hope that you uh, have the time to come and join us again. Thanks for watching tonight. And for now, thanks for watching. And we'll please see. subscribe. We'll see you later. Bye.